Hey guys, so I'm not here again today. We have um, something going on that way. Uh, if you guys need me, link below. I, I'll have either my email address or uh, just links down there to contact me if you guys have questions. By all means, if you got questions, hit me up and I will and I will uh, get back with you. Now, project list for today for you guys. Uh, for ceramics class, you guys are really having to knock out all the pieces that we have due at, by the end of term. Uh, so, working on your coil vases, your coil bowls, the cups with handle and exterior decoration. That's all you guys are doing. You guys are just going through, you know how to do coils, you know how to do pinch, uh, and I believe I showed you how to do slab work as well. Maybe, I don't know. Hopefully, hopefully you guys can go ahead and just start working on all of those pieces. Any designs that you need to do, take care of those first ASAP so that I can check those on Friday, as always. Right, so for these pieces that you guys are making, we have the slab vase, such as this example. Uh, make sure that it is 10 inches high. We have rulers in the back, they're in the... Uh, I got those two big jugs back there on the above the library. Just uh, grab a ruler, make sure your measurements are, are proper. Also, you will have some sort of shrinkage in the clay after it fires. So make sure that you're building just above 10 inches so that when it comes out of the fire, it still meets that 10 inch requirement. Um, coil cup with handle and exterior decoration. Make sure that you're doing an interesting creative design Something that, that's engaging not just for me, but also for a potential buyer. Remember, throw these things up on Instagram. I always want you guys to, to showcase your work, get the stuff out there so that you can be involved in the artistic community. Uh, doing a coil bowl, eight inch uh, diameter and eight inch in height. So make sure, that, again, using the ruler, make sure you're meeting those requirements. And a 10 inch bowl uh, as your diameter with various coil applications. Again, lots of examples I've shown you in, in class. Check out the example that I've got as well. And make something interesting, make something cool, make something fun. Uh, keep working on you guys' pieces. As always, I will see you guys next class. Until then, later guys.